Hello, I'm Dr. Robert J. Gilbert. I'm very proud to be able to bring you this DVD, which contains an introduction to a remarkable body of work related to the Egyptian science of energy. First, let me tell you my own connection to this work. Back in the early 1980s, I spent several years researching biology, chemistry, and physics, finding the geometric patterns behind all natural sciences. Having found those patterns, I then worked for many years to get my PhD in international studies. And during that time, I was able to research over a dozen great world spiritual traditions. And I found that the exact same patterns that I had found in empirical, natural scientific research today, patterns that had been identified in biology, chemistry, and physics as the foundation of all natural and living systems on our planet, these exact same patterns had been known in ancient times to the great spiritual traditions of the world. And these patterns, in the spiritual context, are then known as sacred geometry. Having found this connection between the patterns of natural science that make up our world and the patterns known to the great world spiritual traditions, I then began to teach publicly some of the information I had acquired. While giving a public lecture about six years ago, I had a gentleman come up to me at the end of the talk and ask me, have you ever heard of Dr. Ibrahim Karim from Cairo, Egypt? I told him that I'd never heard of that man. And the fellow that had come to speak with me said that Dr. Ibrahim Karim is a remarkable person who is for the first time making public many of the formerly hidden secrets of the Egyptian inner temple science and of the Egyptian science of energy. I have been very fortunate to be able to study with Dr. Karim for many years and also fortunate that Dr. Karim has made me the first non-Egyptian allowed to teach his work publicly in North America. And at this time, we are offering public courses in Dr. Karim's work, which is known as biogeometry, throughout the United States and Canada. What you're now going to see on the DVD is an introduction, an overview of this body of work. I hope you enjoy it. Hello, welcome to our introduction to the Egyptian science of energy and the remarkable work of Dr. Ibrahim Karim happening today in Cairo, Egypt. Our first illustration is actually of one of the patterns used by Dr. Karim in the biogeometry system. It's known as a biosignature. And this pattern and others like it you will sometimes find in Sufi healing circles and in the Egyptian system and other spiritual systems around the world is a particular a geometric pattern that is related to a particular function of energy. Later on in this presentation we're going to talk about the way that particular shapes will perform particular functions of energy. But the one thing I'd like to bring out about this particular pattern right now is that this particular form should be looked at as a movement pattern of energy rather than just as some type of abstract pattern or as a set of squiggly lines. Think of it as a way that energy is moving to perform a particular activity. This particular biosignature or energy pattern from Dr. Karim's biogeometry system is in fact related to one of the divine names used in the Sufi esoteric system. And in fact, this particular energy pattern is related to the energy of the all-compassionate. Now, biogeometry is a very deep and multifaceted subject. One very important aspect of biogeometry it is that it is a modern version of the ancient Egyptian inner temple science. Now, the Egyptians themselves say that the old Egyptian mysteries were never betrayed to the outside world. In other words, the deeper knowledge held in the Egyptian mysteries have never really been made public. They were held in closed circles of initiates in ancient Egypt. And in more modern times, the secrets of the old Egyptian temple science have been held in small circles of initiates, often handed down from mother to daughter or father to son, in particular groups in the Middle East. It is really the work that we're talking about today, coming from Dr. Ibrahim Karim, that is only beginning to make some of this profound knowledge publicly available. 
So one aspect of biogeometry is that it is a modern form of the Egyptian inner temple science and it brings the principles of this temple science into a form through which we can understand it and use it practically today in our own frame of reference in the West. In addition to being a modern form of the ancient Egyptian temple science, biogeometry is often referred to as nature's own design language of shape, color, sound, and motion. In other words, biogeometry teaches the actual language that nature uses to create all energetic effects and sustain all life functions in the world. We primarily focus on shape in biogeometry, but as we'll discuss in this presentation, color, sound, motion, and in fact all other qualities also come into this great Egyptian science. Biogeometry is based on the key principles of resonance, harmonics, and linkage, which we'll be discussing later in the presentation. Biogeometry is a foundation for geometric alchemy, or a resonance with the gold energy of the plane of divine wisdom. Biogeometry is remarkable for its practical methods to detect, differentiate, and manifest many different specific energy qualities. Because of this, Biogeometry is often uh, learned and used by practitioners of other sciences, such as feng shui, because it allows them to be very precise in detecting and transmuting specific qualities of energy into exactly what they want and need. 